southern rust came in really late this year. Even the farmers that sprayed one pass of fungicide, well, in many areas saw quite a bit of southern rust coming in later. So you are probably asking yourself, oh no, is this going to be a problem always? Well, southern rust, the good thing about it for farmers in the northern part of the Corn Belt, it has to blow up from the south. It doesn't overwinter in the north. So that's kind of one of the nice things about living in the frozen tundra, as I, I call where we farm. Uh, if you live in the frozen tundra, well, it's got to be just the right weather. You got to have southern rust getting started early in the southern part of North America, and then it's got to move up with storms. So will it hit us again? You know, we haven't seen this much southern rust on our farm possibly ever. Uh, and many farmers that I talked to, even down in Kansas and Nebraska, said it's been at least 10 years since it's been this bad. So do I think it'll be that bad next year? Probably not. But just to prepare yourself and protect your crop, you've got to take a look at southern rust and look at the strategies to keep it out of your field.